Okay, so that's the basic technique. Now, the whole principle behind the kicks, as I've already mentioned, and all the movements in Muay Thai are, is using the weight of the body to get the force and the power. Um, so, what we're going to show you now is on the bags. I'm going to show you a couple of variations of the Wien Kang. Um, and then I'll show you just a little tip I have for practicing getting this connection of the upper body and the leg. Okay? So, first of all, we're going to show you the standard Wien Kang, which is where you're kicking at about waist level, kicking um, horizontal to the ground. Okay? Notice there, he's still doing exactly the same technique. He's moving the whole of his body around, and just at the moment of impact, everything comes together at one point, in one moment in time and space. Okay, so he's getting the full weight of his body coming out through his leg. So this is the very basic horizontal kick. Obviously, you can kick to the leg, to the body, to the head. The recommends don't kick too high. It's more dangerous, slower. You can have your leg grabs, etc. So, to keep it low, keep it to the waist section or to the legs. Okay, slight variation on the kick now. This variation is slightly quicker. It's still very hard um, and it's very good for either attacking the leg and the shin and the thigh or the waist here. Now, what we're going to do is obviously going to be kicking up at more of a 45 degree angle. Okay. Uh, Middle of movements, this is actually more preferable in some ways. The full kick, the horizontal one, has much more of a finishing move when you have a little bit more time to start. Okay, so again, the basic techniques. Hopefully from this you'll be able to practice yourself as well. Now, one of the details that I want to explain um, is about pan mat. If you go back to the four Bs, the, the fence, um, I mentioned that the actual pan mat can actually be used as a parry. Uh, one of the advantages of doing the Wing Kang Chaya style is that you're moving. Okay, okay. okay. I don't think it Okay, 
to all you kids out there, don't smoke. It's not good for the health. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we're going to use a pan mat to actually help with the carry. But remember, when we're moving the body back with this movement, we're actually moving the head away from an attack. So this kick is very good to do if somebody's attacking you, if somebody's punching you. So you don't have to think very much about how you're going to, how you're going to uh, counter an attack. Somebody comes swinging their arms at you, just wait for them to come in close, and kick. You don't have to worry about your head or being punched because you're moving out, you're moving away from the line of their attack. So now if I go to punch off, so if I come in for a punch, he's moving his head out of the way. Okay. Now we can actually also use the pan mat in this. So this is another reason why I, why I say use the pan mat to actually start the kick. The punch straight. He uses the pan mat to deflect the punch first. Obviously this takes a little bit more practice, but it's a very useful move. If you practice it when sparring, it becomes very useful because it will actually become part of your basic defense. You want this movement um, to any time you block, any time you use a cripple in. You can actually add this into a cripple in. From here, I can back, back, bang, turn it into a kick. I can pan back, and move further back. Back, kick, in one, pan back. Another jigsaw. Because most of the movements in Muay Thai out, we're using the prick limb. We've already got this horizontal rotation. So once you've got the basics down, you should be able to combine the kick with most of your defence in the same timing. Um, right, that basically gives it, covers it today. So again, we'll just go over the basics what we did. So, okay. First of all, yak power. There we go, chat. Then, green pen. Okay, any questions as usual, please contact me. Don't have any hesitation, I'll answer any questions you have. Okay, great. Thank you very much, Rob. Thank you very much, Yi. Okay, and see you soon.